the Mick the Tent Novice Handicap Chase is next. Two more five furlongs, I say every year. Who's Mick the Tent? 0-120 to this one. Monique Lulia at the top for Martin Little. Magic Girl for David Hooley. Tory Maximus, Paul Rhodes, October Cat, Graham Clutterbuck, Ennery Crime, James Shea, Motley Stu Gray, and Inuit Symbol, Ben Benici. So just seven in this one then. On the Mick the Tent chase. And called in and away. They're going to make their way towards the first of the 13 fences they're going to take in this. And the leader, October Cat, pulling for his head already. These are novices, remember, so expect to see a few thrills and spills in this. Right, two of them might be slightly better over hurlers than these. Ma these fences are massive. And Monique Lulio didn't like the look of it at all and gave it an almighty wallop. And is the back marker at this stage but it's Inuit symbol for Ben Bonici who's in the lead oh, Tory Maximus in second as they come to this ditch and he's gone he's crashed out of it there Inuit symbol took off far too early and never stood a chance really and he's the first one to depart the race I'm fairly sure he won't be the last and it's October Cat who's in the lead from Tory Maximus second Mutley third then Henry Crime Monique Lulier and Magic Girl who was the way David Hoodie's going today You'd have to make that one the favourite, I would think. But it's October Cat in the lead. By about a length. And Grey Monique Lulier has poked through in the second for a moment or two as they get down to the third. Oh, had a few more mistakes there. And Monique Lulier again didn't jump in all that well. She managed to win a couple of times this season, but not jumping particularly well so far today. And October Cat continues to lead then up past the stand. Past the winning post and out for one more circuit of the track. October Cat's in the lead. Then wide on the track, Tory Maximus and Innery Crime. On their inside is Magic Girl. And then Mutley. And then finally, Monique Lulio, the back marker as they get over number four, which they all jump nicely this time. And October Cat continues to lead. And on Mutley, who's made a dastardly looking move around the outside. Then comes Magic Girl as they get down to the fifth. And over that one they go. There's another one gone there. Henry Crime's gone. So Henry Crime got rid of the jockey at that one. And October Cat continues to lead from Tory Maximus and Monique Lulier as they get down to the sixth. Just then all over nicely. Muckley next and then Magic Girl just the back marker. So we're down to five now. So they all pick up some prize money if they continue to get around oh they won't though because Tory Maximus has gone there and Tory Maximus has gone for Paul Road so we're suddenly left with just four and it's October Cat in the lead we're on Motley in second Monique Lulier in third and Magic Girl in fourth There's still one over a mile to go a good five fences or so to jump and October Cat has put a foot wrong so far though in the lead coming out of this next one Jump that one nicely. Monique Lulier over it well in second. So to Magic Girl in third and Mutley in fourth. And this could get interesting now. All four of these still going well. And all four of them still got a great chance into the final mile. They go and race down towards the ninth of the 13. It's all going to come down to the jumping. You can be pretty sure about that. And October Cat is the leader with Magic Girl now being pushed into second. Monique Lulier third, Mutley fourth. All still going well within themselves as they take the next good jump there by Monique Lulier on the outside sees they go alongside October Cat. But October Cat continues to lead. Been in the lead all the way. And leads by a head to Monique Lulier on the outside in second. Magic Girl is third, Mutley is fourth, but no more than a length off the lead. As they swing towards the final three fences in there, Monique Lulier just pokes her head in front for a second or two, but October Cat reasserts, but a better jump by Monique Lulier, and now goes on by a length and a half. It's Monique Lulier from October Cat, Magic Girl, and Mutley back in fourth. Still two more fences to take, though, and Monique Lulier has now gone too clear. This is the final ditch. Monique Lulier took it really well. Magic Girl's in second, October Cat third, Mutley in fourth. Suddenly, Monique Lulier's putting a bit of pace into this race in there. She was a winner on a flat last season. She's suddenly gone four or five clear. It's Monique Lulier with one 
wants to jump into an half furlongs to go, but Magic Girl is in hot pursuit for David Hooley in second. Is Monique Lunier coming down towards the final fence then? Still got two furlongs to race. Magic Girl's getting closer. October Cat third, Motley back in fourth. Jockey on the leader has a little look around, see how much he's got in hand. He stood off that one, gone over it okay though. Monique Lunier is still in the lead, it's a furlong to go. Magic Girl's beginning to get closer. Monique Lunier is in the lead, she's hanging on. Magic Girl's getting closer. Monique Lunier racing up towards the line. Magic Girl in second. Monique Lulier needs the line and she's going to get the line. Monique Lulier takes the Mick the tent from Magic Girl second and then October Cat and Mutley and Monique Lulier a winner on the flat for the last two seasons has now won two or three this year now as well so it's turned into a bit of a stable star Monique Lulier as you can see from the purple colours from a long time ago my old game before the Colours change so Monique Lunio takes it for Martin Little, Magic Girl for David Hooley second, October Cat for Graham Clutterbuck was third, Motley for Stu Gray was fourth, and they were the only finishes.